doing great welcome back to my channel if you're a returning subscriber i know you love my content and that's why you always come back here to watch my videos be blessed thank you for your time thank you for the support but if it is your first time here in this channel please before you leave remember to subscribe and when you subscribe click that notification bell so that you'll be the first one to be notified whenever i upload a new video so dear friends our today's video will be is it advisable to date or marry a man with kids slash dating a white man <laughs> i'm putting a white man because i know most of you who watch my content are interested in dating or marrying a white man and my intention of doing this video of today is to help you out you who is looking for a man or a white man for marriage or for a relationship when you come across a man or a white man who have kids already and may be divorced you can come across this man maybe in the dating sites you can come across this man maybe in real life so you know what to expect from that relationship why am I saying this? It's because recently I've been chatting or helping out girls who are dating men who have kids already. And I can tell you guys, these girls are frustrated because they don't know how it's like to date a man with kids. Also guys, some of you might know, but some of you who don't know, I am married to a man who had kids already so I have experience on this and that is why I am here <laughs> to help you out guys so that you know what to expect you know the whole relationship how it's going to be like and how you should take things <laughs> in your relationship with that man or white man that you want to date who have kids already so guys, is it advisable to date or marry a man or a white man with kids? <laughs> I know some ladies might tell you, no, 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 that's not the type of a man I want to marry. <laughs> Hell no! <laughs> yes guys, it is advisable to marry or date a man with kids or a white man with kids. Why? Because we all deserve a second chance in life we all deserve the second chance to fall in love we deserve a second chance to be loved so yes you can marry yes you can date a man or a white man with kids but and that's when our video of today starts you need to know what to expect from a relationship with a man with kids because it is totally a different thing with dating a man who don't have kids what should you expect or what you need to know before dating this man with kids because guys life is full of surprises <laughs> me growing up i never knew or i did not plan to get married to a man with kids already <laughs> no 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 it wasn't in my plans but life is full of surprises so you don't know whom you are going to marry <laughs> yes i know sometimes in life when you are not married yet you make your own plans the kind of man you want to marry and all that but life is full of surprises you might fall in love with a man with kids already <laughs> yes guys so because life is full of surprises that is why you need to watch this video so when this situation happens to you you remember bella did a video like this and you know what to expect so it won't be a problem you won't be frustrated without wasting much of your time let us start our video Number one, guys, you all know, I always tell you that observe the red flags. So before dating this man or white man with kids, you really need to know if this man is a good man to his kids, if this man is responsible to his kids. Because if he is not, 
then I'm advising you not to date this man because he is not responsible. He is not going to be a responsible partner or husband and he is not going to be a responsible father if you plan to have kids in the future. So you really need to know what kind of a relationship this man has with his kids. If it's a good relationship, if he takes care of his kids, if he is very responsible to his kids and then I'm advising you to date this man or white man or marry him because he is responsible and we want partners or we want to fall in love with men who are responsible. <laughs> Number two that you need to know before you date or marry a man or a white man with children or kids <laughs> is that you guys need to talk you need to talk if this man plans to have more kids in the future talk about it and if he tells you that no i don't want more kids this is enough and i will never change my mind about it i've made my mind i don't want more kids and you find yourself you are a lady who wants kids in your life then you know that it's not the type of man you want to spend the rest of your life with because you want kids in your life and this man is telling you i've made my mind i am not going to have more kids so you end that relationship or you just don't start that relationship because it's not what you want in your life number three that you need to understand before you date or marry a man or a white man with kids and maybe divorced is it divorced divorced <laughs> english can be so hard it's not our language guys but we try so this man is divorced and have kids with this woman you need to know the kind of the relationship this man has with his ex yes guys are they trying to work things out so that they can get back together or maybe they remained just friends after the divorce because this white man it's kind of different what i have observed with our african men because i know in africa people divorce and sometimes it's a war <laughs> Most of them, I'm not saying all, it's a war, 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 war <laughs> between two of you. But here, people divorce and remain friends, good friends, guys. It's not that they have that love relationship or they are still in love with each other, no at all. When these people have kids, or sometimes they don't have kids, but they remain friends. And also in Africa, another thing that I have witnessed by my own eyes, because I'm an African, you find that these people have divorced, everyone has gone on his or her own way, but, but guys, sometimes these people meet and, <laughs> and enjoy the goodies, you know, <laughs> but they are divorced in africa some i repeat not all but here guys when a man divorces a woman or when a woman divorces a man everything is done they are not going to get back together and start making love or cheat on the other woman if the guy is dating another lady they are not going to cheat on that lady it's normal friendship guys so that is why i'm telling you you need to know what kind of a relationship these people have last time i was helping a lady and this lady was very confused because the guy dating is a white man and this guy <laughs> have kids with the lady that he divorced so she told me this man spends a lot of time talking on phone with the ex and when he goes to the ex's house because of course for the kids he spends a lot of time there so this was confusing her so much but i told her to talk to the guy because 
all the answers guys you're going to get them from the man you are dating or the man you want to date so you need to ask this man very well what kind of a relationship he has with his ex-wife is it only a normal friendship all these people are trying to work things out you need to understand it's so important guys number four that you need to know before you date or marry a man or a white man with children or kids <laughs> you need to know that his kids will always be his kids you will never change that because you found these kids with him <laughs> so his kids have got a very special place in his heart and you have your own special place in his heart you cannot replace them so you need to accept that the most important thing that you really need to understand or to know or to look at <laughs> is if this man is treating you good is if this man loves you so much the way you want to be loved if this man is taking a good care of you then that's enough guys don't try to make this man stay away from his kids that's not good and i told you guys if the man is responsible with his kids then he will make a good husband yes guys so you really need to know that number five that you need to know before you date or marry a man or a white man with children you need to understand that kids or children don't know a word divorce even a meaning they don't know at all so these kids need both mother and father to take care of them or as in growing up so this man will always <laughs> be a part of the life of the kids if he has to go to the ex he will go if the kids want maybe the dad if the kids are small in some cases if the kids are going to bed and they want the dad <laughs> To read the stories to them he is going to stay there and read the stories because the kids don't understand anything and they shouldn't even be involved in that divorce thing so everything should look normal to the kids if the kids cry at night and want to see the dad if it is possible the guy will go you will have to understand that <laughs> or if the kids sometimes call they want the father's attention this guy is going to stay on the phone talking to the kids and, and talking to the ex-wife of course because these kids don't have a phone a phone is for the ex so you might imagine he's talking to the ex but maybe he's trying to talk to the kid this man is supposed to continue playing the father role even if there is a divorce so all the special moments of the kids the father is going to be there if it is the birthday of the kids the father is going to be there to celebrate the birthday with his kids because it is his right and it is the right of the kids you really need to understand that don't allow the jealousy push you so much this situation you really need to understand like i said in my previous point that before you start being jealousy you really need to understand what kind of a relationship is there and because you are in love with this man or you have started a relationship with this man you will have to accept this whole situation if you are really in love with this man so it's very important that you understand that kids don't know the word and the meaning of divorce everything should remain normal <laughs> number six that you need to know before you date or marry a man or a white man with children is you need to give a chance to these kids or children to get to know you to gain confidence in you to trust you don't be in a hurry take your time give them time because 
to these kids you are an intruder to these kids you are a stranger <laughs> so don't expect these kids to start loving you immediately when they see you no <laughs> it can't happen that way no these kids need really to know you need to trust you that that you are a good person you are a good girlfriend <laughs> to the father <laughs> before they start showing you the affection give them time i have another example of a lady i was helping <laughs> this lady met the kid of the boyfriend and they slept then in the morning this kid did not say even good morning or anything <laughs> so the boyfriend is a white man a girl is an african and you know in africa kids are told to greet the elders <laughs> especially in her country tanzania kids are told to greet the elders when they wake up or even if you go um, in the streets and meet the elders even if you don't know them you are supposed to greet them <laughs> like in tanzania we will say shikamo this means that this person is elder than you you are as you are saying hello you can't just say hi <laughs> he is not your age mate or she's not your age mate so this lady expected this kid of the boyfriend would greet her like you know a sign of respect <laughs> but this kid did not do that she stayed for a week if i can remember very well but this kid never greeted this lady <laughs> good morning so she was like maybe this kid does not like me why was he like that <laughs> so i told the lady that hey you need to calm down it's not like that before these kids start talking to you or coming close to you they really need to gain trust yes guys because these kids grew up without seeing you you are a new person to them like i said you are an intruder you are a stranger so give them time don't think that they don't like you no for example you know guys i always get real with you <laughs> and sometimes i think too much <laughs> with my own case because i told you i have experience on this because I am married to a man with kids so when I first saw his kids yes they greeted me and they continued with their own business but they were not all that close to me like they are now yes guys they were a bit distant sometimes yes they could greet me and all that but we are not that close at all but as time went by we are best friends <laughs> right now we are best 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 friends they love me and i love them back we have a very strong bond together <laughs> we talk we joke yeah but before it was not like that so don't think that if they're not don't think that if these kids are not that close to you then they don't like you not at all they are kids guys <laughs> don't judge them give them time <laughs> number seven that you need to know before you date or marry a man or a white man with children you need to be friends with these kids and love them never try to be the dad or the mother to these kids because no matter how you try you will never be so if there is any problem with these kids or a misunderstanding between you and these kids don't be the one to talk to these kids talk to the dad because it is his responsibility he will be the one to talk to the kids yes guys you just take your place be friends with these kids love them and if you do that guys there is going to be peace these kids are going to love you yes guys but don't try to be a parent to his kids 
never 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 <laughs> and also before i forget if there is any misunderstanding between the dad and the kids always encourage your boyfriend or your husband to have a good relationship with his kids to bond with his kids don't be the one to add fuel to the fire <laughs> Because <laughs> you've got the chance and then you say, ah, I was waiting for this. I'll add fuel to make things worse. No, don't be that kind of a lady. Be a peacemaker. <laughs> it is my hope you really enjoy this video, which was, is it advisable to date or marry a man or a white man with kids? So now you know, if you come across a man or a white man with children, you know if you should date him or not because i've told you like everything guys <laughs> but if you're someone who is dating or married to a man with kids can you please help us write in the comments below some of the points that i forgot and you think they are so important these ladies need to know before they date or marry a man or a white man with children if you have liked this video please give it a thumbs up share it to your friends family everyone that you think will enjoy this video and learn something or someone who is in need of this video share it with her it will be of a big help comment below what you think about this video i would like to see your comments <laughs> of what you think and please if you have not subscribed what are you waiting for what are you waiting for join the family <laughs> subscribe and when you subscribe click the notification bell so that you'll be the first one to be notified whenever i upload a new video don't forget to watch my other videos too they are so good you will learn a lot of things i love you so much you are always here in my heart let us meet in my next video ciao ciao Mwah.